everyone, it's Lisa here and I have a product review to share with you today and it's the Color Bloom uh, Mist by Prima and um, I have a few of the colors here but I'm just going to show you firsthand how you use it so it comes out of the package, uh, it actually comes in the package exactly like this. Um, so you just pull it out and so you can see the color. So this is the gold foil, which I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. Uh, this will be the first time I spray it. I have sprayed the other ones just to kind of save a little bit of time, but, um, it does have quite a good coverage. It's exactly like a Windex bottle. So, um, just give it a few sprays to start it off and then just, Give it a light spray, or if you want it a little bit more direct, just get a little closer. And then um, you can still take the um, bottom off just like you would the normal ink or the normal spray bottles just to get a little bit of splatter effect on it. And um, the color is quite nice. Um, this is, again, the gold foil, and I just wanted to compare it for you guys to the Heidi Swip Swap Gold LeMay. I know there's a lot of people out there that have the Heidi Swap Gold LeMay, and I just want to compare the colors to you because it's not the same. Uh, but just so you guys can uh, have a little bit of reference, but can you see how shiny that gold is? And we'll just let those little um, dots dry, and then you can see how intense that color gets. Uh, but let's just um, get another piece of paper here. And I'm going to spray the Heidi Swap Gold Lame. And I love the Heidi Swap Gold Lame. Uh, but just if it's not available to you, you could definitely pick up this Prima Color Bloom. Um, just so you can see the difference. I actually do like the color of the gold foil. It's just a little bit of a more brassier gold. So if we do a spray on it, you can see it's quite a bit lighter. And we'll just do a couple flicks. So you can see. And we'll just let that um, sit off to the side to dry just so you guys can see the difference. And I'm just going to clean up my mess and... Um, just I'm going to show you some of the other colors that I purchased. Um, there's quite a range of colors from uh, the Color Bloom. Um, I think there is 12 colors for the first set. Um, they have a, a really nice broad variety of colors. Um, it seems like with the Heidi Swap, there's a couple colors that aren't quite present. Um, so it seems like with the um, Color Bloom, there's a couple colors that the Heidi Swap doesn't have that the Prima does. So that's just a couple tips for you. So um, the first color that I actually bought when I was at the retreat was this color. It's called Glistening Waves. And it's this really soft kind of, I wouldn't say it's like an aqua color, but it's kind of a turquoise color. So really pretty. And you can see these bigger blobs down here, how intense that color gets when you um, do the splattering on it instead of this spray. So very intense. I love that color, by the way. Uh, the next color that I bought was this sunshine. Um, I don't have a lot of yellow uh, mist in my collection. And um, the mustard color I like, but it's a little bit on the orangier side than it is the yellow side. So this is a really nice um, comparison to that. It's very bright, fun yellow. And you can see with the um, splatters here, it's quite intense yellow. So really pretty. And then this one is called Gilded. It's this really pretty orange. Um, again, you can see how intense that orange gets with the coloring down here. And um, it's a really pretty orange, actually. And I'm not a huge orange fan, but I really like that color. <clears throat> and then this is Soft Teal, which it's more of an aqua color than it is a teal. Well, I guess it's still kind of a teal color. But I really like how soft it is. Sometimes you just want a little bit of soft misting. Uh, so that's a really pretty color. Uh, then if you want to get a little bit more intense, this is the Precious Stone um, color and it's got a bit of a blue to it. 
I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up, but almost like a denim color, if you can see that. So, but um, it's got some nice soft gray tones to it too. And then lastly, because I dropped them on the floor, um, there is this um, cotton candy color, which is a really soft pink. And um, Studio Calico used to sell the Cameo Mist, which I used up. It was one of the first sprays I used up and I loved it. And I could never find any other color to replace it. So if you like the Cameo color, this is a very, very close second to it. And I again like it. The other nice thing I do like about these is they have this little stopper on them. So if you don't want them to spray or you want to make sure your kids don't get into it, um, just kind of put that little lock onto it and then you can't, can't spray it. So, um, that's a nice little feature there and it's just easy to pop off and on. So there you go. So now you can see these colors dried. So this is again, the gold foil. So it's a little bit more of an intense, um, gold color and the gold lame is still that awesome gold color I really like both though it's, it's hard to pick a winner there um, but yeah so there you have it uh, that's the color bloom gold foil uh, precious stone cotton candy gilded sunshine um, glistening waves and soft teal. That's my little review on them. Um, if you, I will do a couple of layout shares so you can see them in action later. So, um, thanks everybody for watching. Bye.